Please welcome the Ohio State University Marching Band, widely known as the largest all brass and percussion band in the world. Celebrating our time in London today, we thank the NFL for bringing us across the pond. Then we turn back the clock 50 years for music from the time we Americans call the British Invasion. This is going to be very interesting. This, I think, is their first performance in the UK, Wembley Stadium. I used Massive. To, I used to live around there, about 10 minutes away, so I know it very well. Yeah. And yeah, it's going to be a good performance. Mm -hmm. NFL. Da, 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 da. Nineteen sixty five. The first to arrive in America was the Who talking about my generation. Look at that. I love when they do this stuff. Yeah. On the mic. This reminds me of when Michael Jackson was moonwalking and they'd done that so perfectly. That was amazing. This has that si same kind of vibe. I love yeah. it. Yeah. They've done the splits. Kiss, is it? Oh, that's a tongue. Yeah, yeah that's the oh. mouth, the symbol. Is that a guitar? Yeah, it got it. It's incredible how they can just transition from one position just to another so quickly and smoothly before you even know what's going on it's done they know exactly what spot to go to Man. where to walk where to stand it's great and they're playing at the same time yeah. in sync crazy talent the fat four bubbles to drive my car but we're taking old Rootmaster bus down to Abbey Road during our time in London. And the bus, London bus. You know, the tour bus. <laughs> That's cool. That so quickly they transitioned. Abbey Road.
It seems like just yesterday, but it's time to return the clock to 2015. Let's see what they're doing now. Nineteen sixty five. Do you think they get tired? Because they're like, they're actively moving while they're doing this and they're no. blowing down the trombones and the trumpets and stuff. They're constantly putting up breath while... Yeah, but that's like footballers. They're running from one end of the pitch to the other. Yeah. So it takes a skill. I feel like this is very intense. Like, it don't look it because they're just walking. It will be but intense, but they're so, so used to it. Yeah, they must be. So their breathing technique, their movement. And I think it's all breathing technique. Yeah. Like, I think that's very important. This. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to call time on our show with a swing pass of the local landmarks that we remember from our time in London. Let's see. We thank the NFL for our what landmarks? Us to bring a of That's the Big United Ben. Kingdom Big Ben. As yeah. we celebrate all we share in the very special relationship between our two people. Oh, London the, um, Eye. What's that called again? London Eye. London Eye, that's it. How can oh, you no, not I know? That. I it slipped my mind. It's been a while. That she done that well. Oh, great. It's great. What is that? The middle part is a crown. Yeah, I was thinking. So I don't know if that's meant to represent the Buckingham Palace. Let us know, guys. I mean, we should know we're from we London. We should know, but I can't. I can't we can't make ask it out. Americans no, about London. I can't. I can't make it out though. I think I it's think Buckingham it's a, Palace. All right, we'll go with that. I see a crown in the middle. And they're doing "God Save Our Gracious Queen," so yeah, that's so, linked to that. So yeah. we'll see. What's that one? That's um, don't know. London Bridge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <take that. laughs> Are you sure? No, because I don't know. Because I saw the American flag come up. So I was yeah, like, but what's this? No, but what? When I saw the American flag, yeah, but I it's thought, two towers. Look. Yeah, I know. And then that's the I bridge. Know. But what confused me is when I saw the I American flag. I don't think he's flag. from London. But when I saw the American flag, you I came got straight from Algeria, no boat, didn't you? <laughs> I got confused when I saw the American flag. I thought it was something that we linked and had in common. Quick, one last round before we go. Well, our ensemble is based on the tradition of British brass bands. Today we have a tradition from America to share with you. It dates back to 1936, and since that time has become the signature of American collegiate football, now known around the world. Let's see. with senior sousaphone players Dan Webb and Aaron Kurgis. The most memorable tradition in collegiate band history, the incomparable He's loving it. Ohio.
Don't know what that one is. Do you? They said it's what we've got in common. Or what we share. I see an R. <laughs> I can't make it out. And an I, I, I don't know. And the crowd seemed to get it because they started cheering we as soon don't. as O got it on. Not sure. Is, it says Ohio. Is that Ohio? But why would that be? I don't know. Comment below, guys. I think right. Us. It is Ohio. It says Ohio, but I O H I O. That's how you spell Ohio, no? Yeah, but what I, I was expecting something. Different, because they said Maybe it's because is... they're from Ohio. I don't know. Comment below, guys, if we've got this or not. It must be Ohio, that one, isn't it? Yeah. They do proper attention to detail. So if you look at the eye, it's the guy with the massive trumpet. He's yeah, the dot on top of the, the eye. Yeah, I clever. love that. That's so nice. Yeah, and they've done that purposefully. And it's proper like handwritten joint as well. You know, when they was writing it, it was literally in sync with the other side. Yeah. It, like on the dot. It's proper attention to detail. So well done to them Skill. on that. The Ohio State University marching band. The band is directed by Dr. Christopher Hook. Assisted by Paul Gale, Michael Smith, Four. Sean DeLong, Matthew King, Brian Warfield. Arranged by Jim Square Engine with Mark Reynolds. I'm Dave Garwan. One thing I will say I really like about that is how much respect they had for the UK. Like they kept saying like, oh, you know, nice words about Britain. Well, obviously they're performing in Britain and it makes sense too, but they proper show their respect while being there. And I think that's really nice. It just shows, you know, the relationship the US has with Britain. And yeah, the of course positive, they're allies, aren't yeah, they? Across yeah. the pond, as they say. Yeah. And uh, the alliance is very strong. I love to I see liked it. how they put the land, London uh, landmarks as well. They yeah, incorporated cool. it. That was Even really though cool. I missed one of them. <laughs> one all of them. them. Not one of them. All no, of them. one of them. Whatever. Cool. Guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, comment below more suggestions on what you want us to react to next. For now, peace out. Bye.